Hi, I'm going to show you how to create an event on Facebook. And as I've said before, it will be very, very helpful if you guys use the Facebook boosts to boost the events and get more of your events seen by your followers and people in and around Port Orchard. So um, log into the Facebook page and uh, scroll down to the side where it says events and click on that. So once you do, the events page will show you a list of um, events that you guys have had previously and you will see option to create a new event. So I'm going to click on the create event button. Then I'm going to click on change event photo. That's going to be the header for the page. So I've created a couple of different images for you guys. One is a dinner event and one is a vaccination event. And these are the horizontal ones. I mean, we're sending these to you separately so you guys can use them as need be. I've also created two square ones, uh, one for the um, vaccination and one for the dinner. And I'll tell you guys where you guys need to use these um, in a little bit. So click on the um, horizontal banner for the um, dinner event and click open. And then you can come down here and create an event's name. For example, free dinner workshop with Dr. Tom Holt. Okay. If the event is at your office, you can just leave this as is. Otherwise, you guys can change the name to whatever you guys want. So let's put, for example, China Sun Restaurant. Right. Um, it'll give you a list of um, China Sun restaurants that people have um, checked in before in Facebook. So if they've checked in a lot, it'll probably show up here. In case they haven't checked in a lot to the China Sun restaurant, then um, we may just have to click just to use China Sun restaurant. So we're just going to click on that. Then we're going to give it a start and end time. So let's go, for example, March 9th um, from 8 p.m. till 9 p.m. Then we have to give it a category. I think the best one that will suit you guys will be health wellness. And then put it in a description. And I copied and pasted this from your email earlier. So that's a description for the event. Next, we're gonna to have to give it some keywords. And the keywords are limited to certain ones that Facebook will give you. For example, it won't give you chiropractic, but it will give you, for example, health. So we can use that as a keyword. We can use dinner as a keyword. We can use wellness as a keyword. Unfortunately, we can't do, for example, Seattle or anything like that. So this should do it. They usually give you only three um, options to do so. So um, the next one is click on free admission so people know it's not a paid event. If you guys have a link to a ticketing website, you can put it here. Um, if you guys have a co-host, let's say um, some other company or some other um, restaurant wants to co-host the event and they want their name mentioned here, you can just start typing in their um, page name or the name of the friend and it'll appear here as well. Okay. Once that's done, you can click publish or you can also um, schedule it for a later time to be published. So some people, they want to publish it about a week or a week and a half prior to the event to build up the momentum quickly. So that's what they'll do. In case you guys have more time and you guys wanted to be out there for a longer period of time, you guys can post it now for an event that's maybe one or two months in advance. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and click cancel so it doesn't appear on your timeline. Um, the other thing is once you do post the event, make sure to go to the main page and post the picture, the square version that I've sent you to complement the event. So. Um, you can always click on this little guy that says add your video or photo and click this guy, it's a square one. And once it's uploaded, um, you can say something like, you know, dear fans and followers, please take advantage of our free event. Uh, click on our events page to learn more. And you can go ahead and publish this as well. What I would also suggest for this one is to boost it because um, sometimes events may not show up well in people's timelines. Um, these guys definitely appear better. So 
Um, you may want to boost it in two locations. Maybe put you know, $50 in here and then $50 in the other one. So once you guys are done, click publish and it will publish both to your main page and the events page will publish to your events page. Um, that said, it should be pretty straightforward. And if you guys have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us. Otherwise, good luck. Yeah.